aim So amazing, uh, you see how they playing uh, Live wire, it's all about sports and entertainment uh, You don't wanna miss it, so official like you never seen Keep it going till the whistle blowing from the referee uh, Everything from highlights and stats You know that we gotta run it back Whether on the field or the court You know that this is where it's at uh, Subscribe, no delaying uh, This is Live Wire uh, Sports and Entertainment Let's go What's good, London Braves fans? Alright, London Braves has sweet the, the series With the Florida Marlins um, Taking all three games um, They pretty much Um with a combined score of in all three series is 20, 20, 26 to nine. Yes. Um, uh, now, this is the second time that Ronald Coon had a left the game. They left the game against the Mets and he came back against this series. Now he left the game in the seventh inning due to a pairing sore knee. Um, he got hit in the knee. And everything like that, but um, nevertheless, the Braves still went on to win. Um, Marcel Zuna homer again tonight. He had, um, he had last night. He homer twice. He had a grand slam home run, and then he turned around and had a solo home run. And then today he had another solo home run, which that gives him third for the se- three for the seasons so far. Um, the Atlanta Braves, um, they are six and one against the Marlins this season because they played the Marlins uh, a few weeks back, where the Marlins did one one game. But um, Marcel Asuna, he he was hitting point eleven eleven in just two RBIs going into this game. He went four for nine and with three home runs, six RBIs, and five runs. And Matt also also added a homer in the game. Now, Howard Solo, the former Brave, which I love. You know, I wanted him still on the Braves instead of Marcel, but it's okay. Um, he had a 2-1 homer in the game. He finished 3-5 for five with three RBIs, finished with a triple um, short of a cycle. Um, but nevertheless, um, the, um, the, the Marlins what, did win four straight games before coming back into this series. But the Braves now are the Braves now are um, second in the Nash, second in all the baseball to to the um, uh, what the Tampa Bay Rays for the, the best record in the league. The Braves are had the best record in the National League because since the Pirates had lost against the Rays, that gives the Braves um, that that lead. But nevertheless, the Braves have um, the Braves are playing really excellent ball. They do host the Baltimore Orioles for a three-game set this weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, hopefully, the Braves could continue this hot streak uh, when this game. The Braves are now twenty. What I think they are 22, 22 and nine, something like that. They twenty twenty two and nine. Um, let me double check and make sure. Yeah, they twenty two no twenty two and ten. They have um they on a three game win streak. They eight they eight and two in the last ten games. Um, so like I said, they do. Um, the Marlins is sixteen and sixteen behind Dune. The Mets is sixteen and sixteen. The Phillies is fifteen and seventeen. The Nationals thirteen and eighteen. Um, the Pirates are twenty and twelve. Um, so the Braves do have um, a two-game lead over them so far. Um, the Milwaukee Brewers was a hot team earlier, but then they faltered. They eighteen and thirteen. The Dodgers seemed like they they was coming on. They had won six straight. They was they eight and two in their last ten games. Now they lead the the NL West. They nineteen and thirteen as as we speak right now. The Padres seventeen and fifteen. They two back. So that division is gonna be pretty tight. But right now, if you look at the Braves had a six game lead in their division and which solely they'll probably keep a stranglehold on that division as the season may go. But like I said, the Tampa Bay Rays lead the league with 26 and 60, 20 games over 500 as we speak. So and then the Braves is second 
with their second best record. So there's only three teams in the league right now that has 20 wins, the Pirates, the Braves, and the um, the Rays. Uh, uh, also, the um, like I said, the Braves, they, they will – they do play, they do play um <clears throat> they do play um the Baltimore Orioles this weekend which hopefully matter of fact let me see what the Baltimore Orioles record is pretty much so we'll f- figure out um the Baltimore Orioles actually the Baltimore Orioles is the fourth team with twenty wins so they twenty one and ten that's so that's gonna be a pretty good game against the Braves so that's gonna be another test for the Braves to see how well they can can they sustain all of this. Um, success they have in early on in the season. If they come out of that three game sweep, least I mean that three game series, least two wins out of three, then hey, that's that's good, you know. Um, so let me let me double check something real quick. All right, so now and um, like I said, they. They have a six game lead in the division. They um three game they finished the three game sweep. They're twenty two and ten right now. So all in all, um mentor, he was fabulous today. It, you know, he had his seventh save of the season. Um so I mean you can't you can't really expect too much. Can't expect too much from the Braves did what they had to do. They came in and won the game. And keep it down. We had to keep a close eye on Ronald Ronald Cole Jr. going into this game. Now he does have um, he has 15 stolen bases, has ma- as many or more stolen bases in the last than five teams. So he's going to be crucial, you know. So hopefully he's um he'll be a little bit better. But we'll get an update on that tomorrow. But then again. Let's give a shout out to our Atlanta Braves. They're doing they're doing what they needed to do and they're keeping it going. So shouts out, chop chop, Atlanta Braves, let's go.